Well, hello, boys and girls, and welcome to Tea Time with Mr. T and... Sophie! And as always, we have our cups up. Is your cup up? Pinky's up, and we're going to come in for the... Clink! There we go. All right. I'll take uh, yours from you real quick. All right, boys and girls, we are very happy that you could join us today for Tea Time with Mr. T and... Sophie. So what we're going to do is go back to the farm. That's right. We have another great video for you coming up. And wait, Mr. Mr. Fox, what are you doing? You walked right in front. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm Hi, sorry. Mr. Fox. Hi, Sophie. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt. It's just, I'm just on my way to gymnastics class. Gymnastics. That's pretty cool. Sophie can, does gymnastics. Can you show us some of your tricks? Well, you know, I'm running late. I just, I gotta go. I'll, I'll see y'all later. Okay. Enjoy Bye. your tea time. Bye. All right. Wow, he's, he's uh, really in a hurry. He's going to gymnastics. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I go to gymnastics, just so you know. Yeah, so like I was saying, we're going to be going back to the farm with another, what, Gonga? Gonga, what are you doing? Oh, Gonga. hey. Hey, I was just... You know, I'm on my way to gymnastics. Wait, Gunga, you just got here and now you're in gymnastics too? Yep, yep. You know, gotta go stretch my legs out a little bit. I'll see you all later. I don't, I don't suppose that you could show some of your tricks? I can show you one. Ready? Whoa, Whoa Gunga, that Gunga. was amazing. Gunga, when he's, he's still going. He took off. He's still going all the way down there. Man, Gunga, what... What a what an athlete, huh? Yeah. And uh, <gasps> Mrs. Duck, what are you doing? Uh, don't let me, let's guess. Do you think she's going to gymnastics? Gymnastics, huh? No, no, not gymnastics. That's why I have this towel. I'm going swimming. Oh. Well, but it's kind of isn't it kind of wet and rainy? I'm a duck. I'm a duck, Mr. T. It's going to be okay. You're um, gonna be cold. <laughs> Okay, well, all right. Now it's time to, like I said, it's time to get back to the farm. This is Click Clack Surprise. We're yeah. back to Farmer Brown's farm. I'm going to go back there. Okay, and you want to join, in. sit with the boys and girls? Yeah. Excellent. All right, there you go. Make sure you don't step on any toes. I'm going to get you guys a little bit closer so you can see. This is by Doreen Cronin and Betsy Lewin. All right. Click clack surprise. I wonder what this is gonna be about. Maybe. You guys have any guesses? Uh, maybe a farm. A farm. Click clack surprise. Or a surprise. Okay. Here we go. It is a very big day on the farm. A cake is baking. Streamers are streaming. Mice are floating past the window. The invitations have been delivered. You are invited to Little Duck's birthday party. Under the maple tree, cake, games, prizes. Pin the tail on the donkey has been crossed out, canceled by donkey. Duck, duck, goose, canceled by goose. Steal the bacon, canceled by anonymous request. Anonymous means they didn't say who it was, but do you think you might know who did it? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Everybody wants to look their best for Little Duck's party. Duck takes a long hot bubble bath to look his best. He rubba dubs, rubba dubs, rubba dubs clean and walks on over to the maple tree. Little Duck watches then rubba dubs too. The little duck has his own ducky. The sheep need a trim to look their best. They snippity clip, snippity clip, snippity clip clean. And walk on over to the maple tree. I think there's like, it's, it's, it's a pattern, like walk on over to the maple tree. Little duck watches and then snippity clips too. The cat wants to look her best. She slurp a lurps, slurp a lurps, slurp a lurps clean. And walks on over to 
The maple tree. Little Duck watches and then slurp a lurp lurps too. The chickens take a dust bath to look their best. They shimmy shake, shimmy shake, shimmy shake clean. And walk on over to the maple tree. Little Duck watches and then shimmy shakes too. The pigs need a mud bath to feel their best. They squish and splash, squish and splash, squish and splash clean. And walk on over to the maple tree. Little Duck watches and then squishes and squashes too. The cows like themselves just the way they are. No rub-a-dubbing, no snippity-clipping, no slurp-a-lurping, no shimmy-shaking, no squish and squashing. They walk on over to the maple tree. Farmer Brown frosts the cake, lights the candles, puts on his best hat, and walks on over to the maple tree. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. A birthday surprise for everyone under the maple tree. Boy, look at little Tuck. <laughs> Um, look at a group picture. Look at little duck. And after they're all cleaned up. All right. You want to come back up here, Sophie? Come on up to finish us up. So before we go, after those our stories, well, first we always want to ask, did you like it? Was it a good story? Yeah. It was a good one, right? Now we had a, oh, there's Ellie. Ellie has come to join us. Ellie the elephant is here. <laughs> now, a couple questions about our story here. To gymnastics. Oh, and Ellie's off to gymnastics too. A couple questions. Who are the characters in that story? Little Duck. Yeah, you know what? They're going to they're gonna write down the answers for us. So. And what was the setting of the story? And finally, what happened at the beginning? Beginning, what happened in the middle, and what happened at the end of that story. All right, all right, boys and girls. Here you go, Sophie. We are very glad you joined us here for tea time with Mr. T and Sophie. And we want to do one last salute before we go. So, cups up, pinkies up, because we are so so very fancy, and we're gonna come in for the. Clean. All right. Goodbye, boys and girls. We'll see you next time.